Alright, that's enough admiration. Welcome back to Let's Play Control. I'm Burning Dogface, and last time I got my hands on the service weapon, this particularly interesting shape-shifting gun, which, which uh, they suspect used to be uh, King Arthur's sword Excalibur and Thor's hammer Mjolnir. So that's, um, terrifying. Something pop up. Breach the hotline. The hotline. Says the dead man. Okay. Oh boy, here we go. Ah, that's not a wall. Play that game, asshole. Oh, right. Stop trying to reload. Or keep twitching the shoulder and messing everything up. Oh, fuck! One, grip is reliable with semi-automatic fire that's deadly at short and long range. Ammo efficient. Where did I get this? I didn't I didn't pick this up. I've just been running around. I had to hold F to pick anything up. Ammo cost for shot minus five percent. Exclusive to shatter spin grip. What? Oh. Oh, Grip is the name of the weapon form. Like, the pistol form, I guess? It's a silly name, but... I'll install that thing in just a bit. I just oh god. Oh, those are those little dots are. Those are also health elements. Or those are the health elements they were talking about. Are these guys dead or not? If I shoot this guy, is he just going to suddenly fall down? I mean, if they're being held prisoner, I don't want to murder them, but if they're like... Oh, if they're already dead and their brains are being used for computers or some nonsense. I don't know, I thought of the, the weirdest thing I could come up with in the at instant off the top of my head. Don't read confidential correspondence. It's not just rude, it's illegal. Do they have an enchanted stapler here somewhere? What are those? Oh, little miniature American flags. Of course they are. How typical. Um... Man, I did not come here for a job. 
And I have a really unfortunate uh, feeling like this is exactly what that Ati guy meant by the janitor's assistant. Oh, uh, what a poorly made desk. Let's work hard. His life is in your hands. Everyone's safety depends on you. <laughs> uh, dinner reservations. Where are my lozenges? Here they are. Let's see. Reminder, redrafting any public facing... Wait, what? Oh. This is the one I found before. I guess I found this before I died. Don't let mold hit your ride. Perform daily body checks for foreign plant matter. Lozenge Wrapper says, don't give up on you. Mwah. Very nice of you. <laughs> I needed that when I was like, oh my god, what am I going up against here? Looking good. Never worn that suit, mind you, but, you know, looking good. Anyway, that envelope is the same one from before. Federal Bureau of Control, 34 Thomas, uh, something. New York! Haha, <laughs> United States of America. That's not what that says. Until... Fucking handwriting. I can't read that. Wait. Wait, that poster. Avoid modern technology. Synchronicity Research Department. I really don't like the impression I get that that's because all of the devices they mentioned in that one file were, uh, capable of wireless internet. Because that has, uh, implications I don't like. Like something could hitch a ride on the signal and get out. Okay, fine. Ah, there it is. I knew there was one of them in these back rooms. Executive meeting minutes. Oh boy, how exciting. What? No, I'm in the wrong one. Oh, there we go. Ah, there's the dinner reservations. Okay. Reservations at 7 p.m. at Shea Ambra. Cheambre, sorry. Um, wife will meet you there. Don't be late. Flowers are ready for you at lobby reception. Remember, she is turning 46. Huh. Something odd about that one. Uh, Federal Bureau of Control. Ag agenda items for next executive meeting. Rising costs of AWE response. Update on mold eradication efforts. Upcoming annual salary review. New supplier of coffee filters to be found and vetted. Please come prepared. Thank you for your time. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to look up what that uh, Latin slogan means. Okay, so, uh, as near as I can tell, it's probably supposed to mean discover, investigate, control, but it's, uh, very poorly translated. Uh, the second and third words are nouns, not verbs, and the first verb is in the singular first person, which doesn't make any sense for an organization. So it actually translates to, I, the investigation, find the empire. And this person uh, theorizes that they must have run the words one by one through Google Translate or something. And a more accurate one would be Invenimus Investigamus Coercimus. Or, you know, Impiramus, not Impirimus, I guess. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, I did forget to restart my timer, so I just push that mute on and off I go. Oh yes, where, where, the, where did I find this? I'm really uh, annoyed with the part where I did not see it. What? This isn't even the, wait. Weapon mods and personal mods. That's mildly horrifying. Okay, let's see here. Where am I finding these things? Ah. 
Like, if someone noticed, like, when I was in the middle of that crazy gunfight, where that happened, uh, throw me a timestamp or something. Okay, ammo cost for shot, minus 5%. What's this? Energy plus 5%. Sure! I'll just mod myself. That seems like a great idea. Collectibles. Oh, these are the collectibles. Yeah, that makes sense. I really don't like that they're all saying the same thing, but not in unison, because that's really weird. Some of these computers still work. I wonder if I can get anything interesting out of them. Probably not. Let's just head out to the corner. Huh. Well, I could, but I won't, because this is very interesting to me. Military standard 8013, max occupancy six persons. Oh boy, the shelter didn't work. Oh, lower first. Oh, it's a toilet. We were meant to be in here for a while. For Marshall's eyes only. Marshall, we checked out the suspected AWE in Duluth wasn't anything. Just like the house fire before this, and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of duds. We need to find better a way to sort the f fake AWEs from the real things. Or you need to rotate these field agents off for a bit. Anyway, we're en route to Sherman Ranch. Next one on the list. Let's hope it's a little livelier there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. I'm calling it whatever happened at Sherman Ranch is related to this. Like, this is where they found th whatever this is. Oh, uh... No, that's not it. There. From H... To H. Marshall from L. Keenum, subject another dud. Noted. What did that say? Hend Rosen? Henda Rosen. Whatever, man. Oh, that was easier to notice. Energy recovery speed, plus 21%. Well, I've never found any use for this energy meter, I noticed. It's not my uh, sprint stamina, so I'll just keep going. Damn, that is a thick-ass door. I'm probably going to shoot one of those guys at some point. I can feel it already. Coffee stain. Yeah, this happened really suddenly. Yeah, I did it again. Whoa. Yeah, I'm not... Again, the name is kind of not filling me with confidence here, given that, uh, as any... I don't know, a psychologist can probably tell you, control is an illusion. Hissing sound that tried to evade me earlier. Burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. Great. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. I can't make out a word. Like just oh no, the word that describes. I caught that much. Oop. God damn it. Uh, fuck, I didn't even see what it was. 
Trench, no disturb. Security order? No. Visitor evaluations! How to handle unscheduled visitors entering the lobby? Start with the following. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control. Established in 1964 as part of an effort to strengthen government relations. We are proud to serve the United States and her people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed nation's infrastructure. If they do not leave, then ask them these questions. Number one, are you here to see someone? Number two, are you from New York City or just visiting? Number three, how'd you find this place? If their answers are sufficiently harmless, explain that this is a secure federal office and that they'll need to leave. Uh, if their answers seem redacted, escort them to a private room. There, perform the Gunnar's psychological assessment. If their responses are in the acceptable range of deviance, see the provided scoring sheet, then redact it immediately. Remember, there's no such thing as too suspicious. Oh, boy. I, uh... I've just recalled that I have disabled the uh, mouse cursor itself, so uh, you guys can't see that. Okay, just a moment. All right, I have returned. Urban Legends. Examination of Paranatural Topics Urban Legends. Summary. Urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also di dictate the characteristics of an altered world event. Urban legends are understood as the modern evolution of Jung's archetypes. What? We recognize certain redacted, informed by our own redacted and popularized by the media. We have additionally proven that urban legends can even be artificially uh, redacted in popular culture using redacted, our bureau-made anthology television program. Once the seeds are sown, human imagination exacerbates the details. So what, like, the Twilight Zone is made by the Bureau so that to shape the way people thought about things or something? That's the impression I get from the anthology television program. Oh, I bet it was Night Springs, the show that our Alan Wake used to write for, because this does take place in the same universe. Uh, certain par paranatural phenomenon contain clear elements of popularized folklore, AWEs that only occur on red and redacted, a pair of scissors that consume human redacted, through two punctures on the redacted. These details, living in the minds of so many, have been given strength through belief. A pair of scissors that consume human blood through two punctures on the neck. It's a vampire thing. Hmm. These details, living in the minds of so many, have been given strength through belief. Urban legends are not just stories for children, they are paranatural realities waiting to happen. Refer to file 4-93-6942 uh, for full report. Oh boy. Yeah, I got that. Oop. That one's glowing. That's a guard. Well, you're trying to get your heads out of your asses. One of you guys has died already. You're really going to have to do better than that. Okay, that was amazing. I'm not going to lie. I felt great about that. Get out of my house. Oh, they drop the mods. I really don't like that uh, the disintegration animations make it seem like they're getting up at first. That's a well-made monitor. Or that image is only painted on. Not that well made. Whoa. Thank you. 
things, I guess. There's uh, an option in the menu to disable uh, copyrighted music if you're a streamer or a Let's Player, but honestly, it kind of ruined some scenes in Quantum Break when I did that. Like, there's a bit where you get into a van, they start the engine, and the joke is supposed to be the song that's playing on the radio when the car starts. But for me, it was just, they start the car, the two characters slowly look at each other, and one of them goes, Really? Like, I was really disappointed that they don't replace the removed music with anything. It's just n silence. So I think I would rather have to, you know, demonetize a couple of videos and give you guys the full experience than go through it without the, uh, you know, the music they wanted to be in it. Quiet, you. Can I get back up if I go down there from here? Ah, yes, I... No, I can't. I get it! There. Oh, hell! Ranger 2nd Class Belaski. Oh, hell! How is there not a crouch button? And we're running. If I slow down the clicking... Excuse me! You be dead! Plus six percent. Yeah, I'll install that one instead. Assets. I don't have a clearance level. House memory. Hidden trend. Undefined reading. Yes, I fucking get it. There, I'm not tracking it anymore. Eat shit. I don't know it's G for that. For fuck's sake. Do I have to read it out loud for you to be satisfied? Because I did earlier. I got through this entire thing. There, I succeeded at the the fucking test, and I'm now the director. Yay. Sorry, that just annoys me very, very much for some reason. Oh. Cleanse the control point. What does that mean? Help me fix it. Um, I don't know what that means. We're going to have to find out next time because the timer did go. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll uh, see you next time on Let's Play Control, when we find out how dark this corner can get. No, uh, when we... Well, do whatever is going on over there, I guess. Later.